Well, Monaco looked to close the gap at the top on Friday night at the Stade Louis du, having title rivals PSG weren't in action until Sunday. Monaco on a run of nine games in all competitions unbeaten. Rance arrived in the Principality after back-to-back -back league wins. And incredibly, the visitors had never lost in their five meetings with Monaco previously. That included a draw in the league in the corresponding fixture and dumping Claudio Ranieri's men out of the Coupe de la Ligue. Well, Monaco showed their intent straight from the off. And it was João Matinho's corner after eight minutes. He found the head of Valier Germain. His terrific near post header. Given Monaco the lead. That Germain's third in five appearances for the 23 year old. Well, satisfaction for Monaco. 1 0 up at the half time break. It was a tight opening period. And then four goals arrived in an action packed second half. And after 53 minutes, it was one apiece. Prince Oniange taking the ball into feet from Odea Fortes. Terrific touch and strength. And finding the bottom corner. Well, Ricardo Carvalho and Eric Abidal unable to stop the striker from making it all level. But ten minutes later, Monaco were back in front, and it was from the unlikeliest of sources. Out on the left, Jeremy Toulon cut inside and found the bottom corner. Well, the first goal in almost a year, but in French football, his second ever in Ligue 1, the other in 2004 as a 21-year-old for Nantes. But the lead didn't last long as Reims hit back again for the second time. Well, sub Floyd Ayiti's first contribution was to whip in the free kick. And when Danigel Subasic clattering Luvan Kurzawa and Ayesa Mandi, well, Oniangi was left with the simplest of finishes. But terrific finish into the top corner, his first league and double and seventh of the season. But Rance's chances of taking anything from this match were dealt a blow when Mandi's high boot. And connection with Kuzawa's chest, leaving Anthony Gutierrez no hesitation but to send him off. And in the final twist, Monaco snatched all three points. Fabio's cross finding James Rodriguez. And Kuzawa was on hand to smash home when it came off the post. Terrific cross from the Brazilian Fabinho there. And the Colombian Rodriguez hitting the post. Kuzawa couldn't miss a massive win, his fifth of the season from left back. The final whistle meant they are only two points behind PSG for the capital outfits in action on Sunday.